We continue the deformer menu and reach the morph. The morph deformer uh, does not use uh, allow. We have to deform uh, the object before and the morph deformer just add a falloff or field for your changing. For that, right click on your object in a rigging tag. We have something called pose morph. I will be explain all of tags in detail. Don't worry, but do the same as I do. So just click on a point. I want to deform the point of that sphere and this window will be pop up. You can double click and change the name. For example, pose A, pose B. You can add any pose. Just make sure that it is selected. This is base pose, this sphere position pose. And I want to change the position of the point with the brush and record it to the A position here. So go into the point mode, right click, go into the brush. It's in a bell, not important. Just click and drag to deform your object as you want for example in this direction <clears throat> going to our tag and this record to the apples and you can change it here this is pose morph tag the important thing definitely go to the animation tab going to the model mode the animation tab means that we can use that pose morph to other comments okay select the object and holding shift and click the pose morph two things happened the pose morph going to the child of the sphere and in the settings in the object in a morph it's automatically defined that tag if that tag wasn't there nothing happened you have to click and drag that tag manually here and here you can as uh, you can <clears throat> change the strength of that tag that you can do it in a tag but a uh, interesting th thing happened here that when we assign the pose morph that the morph deformer that object that has a pose morph you can add a field here for example you can add a linear field here <clears throat> that you control that you can control amount of the pose morph like this you can uh, execute the object the, the comment with the linear fall off or or you can delete it select it and assign a, a spherical field click and drag as you can see you can uh, do like this What happened here in the spherical field in middle of that the 100% of the that morph is the uh, is the 100% of strength of common is here and with the fall off it goes to the zero at the outside of the spherical and you can change it to uh, change the how the strength of the common will be effect in a free call mode this is fields as you can see the outside of the that field we have one person strength of that common this is basic of the fields i will be explaining field in details we have lots of sitting here don't worry if you go into cloner i will be explaining that field. but it's very easy you can control your amount or strength of your common with a shape, linear, spherical, cylindrical, that all fields. Another important and interesting usage of that morph deformer is, for example, with a pose morph, we open the mouth of that character and we want to doing some those effects. Uh, we can, you can do it with a um, morph deformer you, you first uh, open this mouth of character with a um, pose morph tag and after that with a, a free call effect you can uh, deform your mouth of your character like this in this method you can you don't need to any rigging special rigging of your system so you can simply do it with the fields 
What happened here? As we can see, this red circle is 100% uh, of that pose morph is uh, activated here, but the outside of the uh, that circle with this red circle and the red circle, we have a smooth fall off to this part is 100% of that common. We are going to the 0% of that common in the strings. And you can use those effects here. You can do, um, you can deform your uh, object like this without any uh, complex rigging. But if you don't use this deformer, you have to go and uh, do a lot of complex uh, rigging, face rigging to do that. So this is very important and usage in a face rigging if you want. Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.